Hello, we saw how Pranjali Ta in his speech uh, this last Thursday. He mentioned something very interesting regarding to uh, the Hurricane Irma and the tragedies that is happening in the United States. So, and around the board actually, around the board. So he mentioned somebody brought the diagram of the Hurricane Irma that where, where it is going, where it is heading. So, and they showed it to a kid, a three-year-old kid. A three-year-old uh, three kid saw the picture and said, Abba is the sofa. If you look at this diagram, it's the shape of a sofa. So what is happening? Right? Obviously, this is a message for us. In fact, there is a famous story by, uh, by Hafez Chaim. That many years ago, you know, Hafez Chaim passed away on 1933. So many years ago, a Jew from China went to Hafez Chaim. And uh, he started talking about Jewish life in China. Back then, it wasn't that much. So he started talking about, you know, this individual, that individual. Hafez Chaim interrupted him. He stopped him. He told him, please tell me about the earthquake that happened in China. Tell me about that. So he was wondering why Rabbi is asking me about the earthquake. So he inquired from Hafez Chaim. Hafez Chaim said, because the individual lives are important, but when something happens, a tragedy happens in another corner of the world, Hashem is sending a message to all the Yehudim, to all the Jews, that you need to do Teshuvah. Right. Especially this time of the year, Chodesh Elul, that is the time of Ira and Teshuvah, Hashem is sending us a clear message. First, it started by uh, you know, hurricane in Texas. Then now in, in Florida, right, category 5. To in uh, year 2005, there was a hurricane that brought many damages, and that was only category 2. Hurricane Andrew. They say this is category four, five. And the letters are Irma. So somebody was suggesting these are the same letters of Ira. Irma, Ira. That Hashem wants us to have fear of him, to do Teshuvah, to look into our actions. Right? Perhaps there is room to improve. Right? Gemilot Hasadim, caring about each other. There is so much room to improve. Right? And this is Mamesh right before the big judgment day, Rosh Hashanah, that Hashem is judging us on the first day and the whole world on the second day. So Hashem is sending clear message, right? So much so that we see in uh, Barakhi Nafshi, Barakhi Nafshi that we said on Rosh Chodesh, Oseh Malachab Ruchot, that Hashem uh, use, uh, uh, Hashem uses his, uh, his winds, winds as a shaliach, as shaliach, as a messenger to send us messages. Right? All of this wind and the hurricane and the earthquake in Mexico, right? and so many, uh, so many other tragedies that we don't even know and it doesn't get to the news. It's sending us a clear message that we are responsible for the whole world, we are the Am Seguda. If something is happening in that corner of the world, it's not that it's happening only for them, no. Hashem is sending us a message that we need to do Teshuvah, we need to improve our characters, we need to improve uh, Shemirat, uh, Mitzvot, Senyut, so many other things we need to improve, and there is so much room to improve. Be'ezat Hashem Abu should help us that we all uh, receive clear messages of Hashem and, and, and look into our actions to see what we can improve. Amen. Amen. Amen.